Janice Leonard is in her mid-70s. She had a total hip replacement just over one year ago. Every once in a while you hear a little click <laughs> when I do leg circles, that kind of stuff. Was there ever any doubt that you would bounce back? And, and what, what, no. what enabled you to bounce back? A determination not to sit and do nothing. Three weeks after surgery, Janice was teaching yoga classes and proving that when you keep yourself in shape, you bounce back more quickly and more strongly, even from major surgery and even in your 70s. You're never too, especially doing yoga, you never, and Pilates, you're never too old to do any exercise. You just have to know your limitations and do what you can and not to push yourself too hard and wind up getting hurt. That's the most important thing. Janice grew up in a housing project in New Orleans where the only thing she loved more than swimming in Lake Pontchartrain was dancing. By age seven, she was taking lessons in jazz, tap, and ballet. At 20, she moved to Los Angeles and studied at the Lachine Ballet Academy in Beverly Hills with Peggy Lipton, Victoria Tennant, Alexander Gudnoff, and Sid Charisse, among others. In her 60s, after more than 50 years of wear and tear on her muscles and joints, Janice transitioned to yoga, Pilates, and ballet bar, and quickly developed a large following as a talented teacher of all levels. It just makes me feel better because I'm helping other people do classes. Because after class, I mean, it, it's so nice when somebody comes up and says to me, you know, I just enjoy your class so much, just listening to you. It just makes me feel better. That makes me feel good, that I'm helping other people. And that's why I like doing it. And she does a lot of it, teaching six days a week, 15 to 16 classes total. Even that wasn't enough to satisfy her students, so she got a team from the prestigious USC Film School to shoot a series of DVDs, Yoga, Pilates, and Ballet Bar. Now anyone can work out with Janice in the comfort of their own home. And we bring the arms back forward, and we bend the knees, legs stretch, and we hold on to those ankles, we stretch forward. Known for her elegance, grace, and low-key style of inspiring students of all levels, Janice is not a hands-on instructor. I never touch anyone in class. I tell them I don't like doing that because you never know if someone has an injury and you don't want to move somebody the wrong way and hurt someone. So I said, just try to follow me the best way you can. And what you can't do, relax and just take it easy and then join back again once you feel that you can come back and, and continue in the class. And sometimes you don't have to push to be in shape. You just take it easy and do a little bit at a time and it would come easy for you. For Janice Leonard, life in her mid-70s is active, engaged, and filled with purpose. Not at all what she thought it might be. It's much better. Well, actually, you know what? It feels great. It really does. It's, um, I never thought about it as being old. You know, I really didn't. It seems like if we think about age, what we think about is what the culture and the society has told it's, us to think about it. That how you should feel, you should be old, you shouldn't, you shouldn't do this, you shouldn't do that, you know, you shouldn't, I, I don't know, it's just crazy. You, you should do whatever you feel good about doing. For Janice Leonard, that's sharing her time, her talent, and her message with others. You can always get better, always, no matter how old you are. And I intend to keep doing it. 